Individuals can develop cancer due to a variety of different reasons, including aging, environmental exposures, and certain lifestyle factors. Cancer can also be hereditary. Hereditary cancer refers to a cancer that develops in an individual that was born with a mutation in a specific gene that puts them at risk for a certain type or certain types of cancer. A genetic counselor is a healthcare professional with specialized graduate training in both medical genetics and counseling. Genetic counselors work as a member of a healthcare team to help patients and families at increased risk of developing cancer. Genetic counselors often use an individual's personal and family history to determine if an individual would benefit from genetic testing. Genetic counselors can also order the appropriate test and help with the interpretation of that test result. Most importantly, genetic counselors help patients understand their cancer risks by educating them about appropriate medical screening and surgical options. An individual may be referred for cancer genetic counseling if his or her personal or family history suggests that there might be a hereditary form of cancer. Those features may include early age of diagnosis with cancer, multiple individuals on the same side of the family with a specific type of cancer, and also individuals that have been diagnosed multiple times with cancer. The purpose of a genetic counseling session is to assess the likelihood that an individual has a hereditary form of cancer, provide education about genetic testing options and cancer risks, as well as help an individual make a decision about whether or not genetic testing is important to him or her. A cancer genetic counseling session typically lasts an hour. The genetic counselor will begin by taking a detailed family history with special attention being paid to those individuals in the family who have been diagnosed with cancer. They will ask the individual's relationship to you, the type of cancer that person was diagnosed with, and the age at which that person was diagnosed with. The genetic counselor will review with you the genetic testing options, review the benefits and limitations of any genetic test, and help you make a decision about whether or not genetic testing is right for you. If you have had genetic counseling and testing in the past, it is important to keep in touch with your genetic counselor. Changes in your family history may change the recommendations about genetic testing and whether or not genetic testing is indicated. In addition, genes are constantly being discovered and updated genetic testing may be an option for those individuals who had negative previous genetic testing. In order to get the most out of your genetic counseling appointment, it will be important for you to know about your family's history of cancer. It will be important for you to know who in your family has been diagnosed with cancer what type of cancer that person was diagnosed with, and the age at which that person was diagnosed with cancer. Your genetic counselor will ask you about your children, your brothers and sisters, your parents, your aunts and uncles, your cousins, and your grandparents on both sides of your family. If anyone in your family has had genetic testing in the past, it would be very helpful to bring a copy of that test report with you to your visit. You can bring your family member with you to your genetic counseling visit. Many people find it helpful to have someone with them because there is a lot of information discussed and a second set of ears can often be helpful. Genetic testing is most often performed on a blood sample. Most of the time, the blood sample can be obtained immediately after your visit with your genetic counselor. Test results can take anywhere between one to eight weeks, with most of the time test results coming back in two to three weeks. When the test results are available, it really is up to you how you receive them. 
Most individuals prefer that the genetic counselor call them on the phone and discuss the test results. Others, however, would prefer to come in in person and discuss the test results. In addition to coming into Boston, patients can get genetic counseling and genetic testing at our sites in Waltham and in Danvers. In order to make an appointment, you can call 617-724-1971 and schedule an appointment at any of these facilities. A genetic counseling appointment is typically covered by most insurance companies. However, it is important to check with your individual health insurance company to determine if a referral is required. Genetic testing is often covered when medically indicated. Factors such as types of cancer, the age at which an individual was diagnosed, and the family history information will help determine eligibility. The genetic counselor will review the details about genetic testing coverage at your visit. They will help you and the laboratory navigate with your insurance company to determine whether or not it is covered.